Hey everybody, Rick Needham handicapping Thoroughbred Racing on Thursday afternoon, October 13th, and this is my Equibase Winter Circle East Coast Racing Report. Let's go to beautiful Belmont Park first for race number 6, 3.40 p.m. Eastern Post Time, 6.5 for a long sprint on the dirt track. Phillies and mares, 3 years old, an up race for an optional claiming tag of some $44,000. Tenders number 7, Lady on the Run. Number one, those lion eyes. Number four, no more stress. And number eight, Stella Loose. Number seven, lady on the run, the pace profile leader in this optional claiming field today. Sprinting at her about six and a half furlongs on the dirt has hit the board in power and fashion in four of her last five, winning in both her third and fifth races back. Jockey Mike Luzzi, trainer uh, John Morrison, send her postward today. They've whacked the toe board with 53% of their entry saddle as a team to date. Number one, those Lion Eyes has hit the board in four of her last five adventures with two of those efforts, including a win in her last start, also qualifying as power runs. Race six summary, number seven, Lady on the Run, tops the contenders list, which also includes number one, those Lion Eyes, number four, No More Stress, and number eight, Stella Luch, seven, one, four, eight, in the sixth from Belmont Park. Let's go to Keeneland next in Kentucky, race 8. Their feature, 4.52 p.m. Eastern Post Time for the Jessamine Stakes, 8.5 for a long route test on the turf. Grade 3, 2-year-old Phillies race for $150,000. Contenders number 11, Emerald Gold. Number 8, Falconess. Number 5, So and Rhett. And number 2, Somali Lemonade. Number 11, Emerald Gold, takes a class drop of some 13 track master units this afternoon to enter this graded stakes test. Has hit the board in two of her three career starts to date, including a power run win to Baker, Breaker Maiden in her second race back. Jockey Garrett Gomez and trainer Thomas Proctor send her to post for the Thursday feature. They've whacked the toe board with 57.5% of their entries settled as a team to date. Number 8 Falcon S has turned in power run performances in three or four career starts to date, including a power run win to break her respective maiden, also in her second race back. Race 8 Summary, number 11 Emerald Gold tops the contenders list, which also includes number 8 Falcon S, number 5 Sooneret, and number 2 Somali Lemonade, 11 8 5 2 in the 8th from Keeneland, the $150,000 Grade 3, Jessamine Stakes. Bonus long shots. Let's go to Chucktown, Charlestown Race Course, Charlestown, West Virginia. Race 8, the 15 to 1 bomb. Number 1, Coco Cobana. Drops in class by 4 track master units. Nice overall speed for the short 4.5 furlong sprint. Hawthorne Race Course near Chicago. Race 2, the 12 to 1 bomb. Number 12, So Long Julie. Takes a class drop of 9 units. Nice overall speed for this six for a long sprint. So handicapping from both Belmont Park and Keeneland on a Thursday, Rick Kim for the Equibase Winter Circle reminding you as always to please bet with your head, not over it.